one of the most dynamic capitals in Europe, Rome was once described as the city of yearning. Whether you're hankering for some ancient history, pining for the perfect antique collectible, or longing for a melt-in-your-mouth tiramisu, the eternal city is likely to come up with the goods. It's easy to be waylaid by the big ticket sites, endless trattorias and cobblestone shopping streets, but the Monocle travel guide to Rome will lead you through the city's lesser-known neighbourhoods and beyond the usual tourist traps. We will help you discover the boutiques making their mark on international fashion, reveal the 17th-century edifices transformed into guest houses, and navigate you through the bamboozling array of museums, galleries and architecture. Of course, you won't have any trouble finding pizza, pasta, gelato and coffee in Rome, but it's important to choose where you eat with care. Our food and drink pages highlight the innovative chefs making their mark on the food scene and the best spots for an authentic plate of cacio e pepe. We recommend you kick things off by slinging back an espresso with the regulars at Shasha Cafe in Prati. The rich dark coffee poured into fragile porcelain cups helps customers romantically recall the Rome of another era. The cafe was founded in 1919 and owner Rodolfo Shasha has ensured that little has changed since then. The friendly chatter of the patrons, tasteful decor and sheer opulence of the melted chocolate stirred into your coffee are all reasons to start or finish your day here. After a strenuous morning sampling the city's famed retail scene or perhaps taking in a sight or two, you'll be ready for some pasta. Marzapane in Trieste puts a contemporary twist on the old classics and serves up a lunch that plays on well-loved Roman favourites. Opt for the carbonara created by Spanish chef Alba Esteve Ruiz. The extra helping of egg yolk and 14-month-age pecorino make for a standout dish. This stylish wood-clad restaurant has a refreshing approach to the classics and has truly refreshed the city's trattoria scene. For dinner, we suggest the more traditional but equally charming Osteria dell'Arco in the Salario neighbourhood. This unassuming brick-vaulted venue not far from Porta Pia opened in 2008. The list of 150 Italian wines selected by owner and sommelier Nicoletta Bajani perfectly complement the simple menu, with recipes hailing from Chef Cristina Yemi's native Emilia-Romagna region. One of our specialties, the guancia di manzano strano brasata, the beef cheek braised in wine, is good enough to write home about. No matter how well you think you know this complex capital, our guide will give you a fresh perspective. After all, this is a city that has reimagined and reinvented itself for millennia, so there's always something new to discover. Published by Gestalten, the Monocle Guide to Rome is the latest edition in our travel guide series. Cities are fun. Let's explore.